Hey guys, what is up? This is Justin, aka FM Digi, and I am here to premiere my United States ProRel Tier 9 database for Football Manager 2020. I've been working on it a lot. If you've been following me on Twitter, you already know that. If you haven't been following me on Twitter, what the heck? Fix that. Link down there. Okay, let's check this thing out. <music> This is the database. Um, as I've mentioned already and many times on Twitter, this is it. I've been working hard on this in the advanced editor on um, Football Manager. Built a lot of it in uh, the FM19 editor. Was able to bring it over pretty easily into this one without you know too much problems. I had to kind of uh, play around some teams uh, uh, went belly up between the versions so teams I had in my 19 editor I had to replace and move over but this is it this is it you guys are seeing it right now um, nine tiers starts with the United States Premier League Championship League One League Two uh, this is kind of where we have the Vanarama National League in in England I went a little different than that, um, but I have the National League Premier, which is equivalent to the Vanarama National League, and then I have Divisions 1 and 2 for those. I don't have uh, North and South um, because it was kind of hard for me to do two tiers going or two leagues going into one and then having multiple leagues going to them. So basically, this is a three tier turn, uh, pyramid right here. So Division 1 feeds into Premier, Division 2 feeds into Division 1, and then from there we have the United States Amateur Leagues. There. Um, so those leagues will are fed from the Northwestern, Southwestern, Northeastern, Southeastern uh, Amateur Premier Leagues, and those fill in from the National Amateur Leagues, Southern, Atlantic, Valley, Central, Mountain, Pacific. So that's it. I, this is crazy how, how long this was. Um, I've talked to many different people about this. Um, you know, FM Editor was one of the best. Help, helped me out a lot. I could you know, bounce ideas off of him a lot. Uh, I'll link to him down below. Uh, Dan FM Databases on Twitter as well. Uh, Mac Bearded got an early, um, early version of this to check out. Lots of help in there. Talk to Scooter. Um, talk to, uh, let's see, who else? Uh, Kuba Esk, Kubika Esk, sorry, I butchered that. Uh, FM Acid Fire 21 as well. Just so many people I have uh, been able to get help from on this, but it's been awesome. This community rocks. But you guys don't want to hear me rant about how awesome it is. You already know how awesome it is. Let's show you these things. So what we've got, you know, here is in the editor. If you guys have ever played in the editor, I don't know what's wrong with you. Something seriously is wrong with you because this is a crazy world. Um, basically, you have to have your league set up, um, go in and create the fixtures, set up multiple, uh, you know, different competitions. Basically, what I did is um, I took the English pyramid, went into the editor, uh, mimicked everything that was in the English pyramid and brought it over into this one. So there's probably a thousand better ways to do this. I just don't know enough about the database. So this is the way I did it. But you go in here into the Premier League, you can see, um, you know, pretty much everything in here is exactly as it is if you went in and looked in the editor for the database in um, England as well. So we'll go we'll, we'll go look in here uh, nation USA what I did is I just got rid of every single competition in the United States I didn't really get rid of it I just marked them as in, extinct so we'll go ahead and show you that right here sort by reputation so you can kind of see what's going on um, also have some cups in here as well I brought those uh, you know, first off, the uh, FA Cup, essentially, right here, number one. 
uh, Premier League, Championship, League One, some other cups in here, getting in the way, League Two, Premier. Um, yeah, this is some cool stuff. I know the editor is kind of boring, so let's switch it. Uh, switch, bleh, let's switch it over to the game, and you can see everything kind of in real time there. All right, here we go. So I just started a new save. Um, also, one thing you'll probably notice is the dates are different um, than what U.S. is used to now. I mimic exactly uh, England and most of Europe, so we go July to June uh, with that. It's kind of crazy, but yeah, you want to go in and we'll check out the uh, Premier League. Right now, the top four teams go into the um, CONCACAF Champions League, and it's got that listed here. Uh, spoiler alert, if you're still watching, thumbs up number one. I am also working on a uh, CONCACAF Champions League database. Unfortunately, I can't tie it into this, so when that's ready as well as this you will not see these highlighted i don't know why apparently this is an issue other editors have seen but what we've got here is 20 teams you got your champion you've got the teams that go into the champions league there is no europa league yet you know maybe i can work on that or some hero someone else can get that going but yeah that'd be awesome but uh bottom three teams get relegated We'll go down and look at the um, championship. Again, we have top two teams get automatically promoted and then a playoff of the next four, three go down. You see your team, smash that like button when you see your team in here. Um, League one, again, top two go up. We have pro uh, promotion playoffs for the, the next four, uh, third through six, and then four teams get relegated there. The two, we, we kind of get nuts there. Three teams get promoted automatically and then a 16 playoff for one more slot and then two go down into the um, outside the league, we'll call it. Uh, so they go into the National League. From there, we have one team getting promoted to League Two, uh, 16 playoffs, and then three teams going down to the National League uh, Division One. Here we are in National League Division One, and you're going to see two teams automatically promoted, 16 playoff. We've got uh, three teams getting relegated. Division Two, kind of the same. Four teams getting relegated into the uh, craziness of um, U.S. Amateur Leagues. So you're going to see here we have Southeastern Amateur Premier League. One thing you're going to notice is the teams don't really match the regions if you're familiar with the United States geography. I'm trying to come up with a better naming system for that, but I think I'm going to leave it this. Because they do kind of move around, I've seen teams, you know, for example, Emerald here, they'll get promoted, they'll get relegated, they may not be in the same league. Um, I'm not smart enough with the database to figure that out. But what we have here is one team gets promoted, and three teams get relegated. I am not smart enough to do a playoff where, because there are four different leagues in the um, U.S. Premier or U.S. Amateur leagues. I am not nearly smart enough to figure out how to do a multi-league promotion playoff. So, sorry, you you got to really bust your butt to get out of this league. Um, and so it's the same in the other four or the other three. See there, yeah, the United States Amateur Leagues. Whoa, what is that? How did I do that? Um, and then from there, you're relegated into the National Amateur Leagues, and this is the bottom of the bottom. You get two promotions out of here. There are six in here, so each team promotes two up, so that's 12 down. In the um, United States Amateur Leagues, there's four leagues, so each of them relegates three, so 12 and 12 works out. Yeah, here is where the bottom of the barrel is for sure. So you can see, and like I said, I didn't create any of these teams. There's one team I created, and um, anyone with a spotted eye might see it here in the bottom tiers. I did add, a, I got rid of a team, 
Um, there's a story behind it that I'll be releasing as to um, kind of exactly how this pyramid came out. But uh, look for the name Remington Davies. Well, he might be someone of importance in this uh, database. But yeah, you can see the teams here. They're all teams that currently exist in the database, except for the one I added. But yeah, there's either 22, 23 teams in each of the National Amateur League leagues. And then we have the uh, Football Association Cup. I did have to create a past winner, and that was because I do have Community Shield as well, where the Premier League winner and the um, FA Cup winner meet. It freaked out when I did not have a uh, previous winner for that because it's played in the preseason of the regular Premier League schedule. We also have a National Cup, which mimics the, um, oh, what is it called now? The League Cup. Um, I'm spacing on the name. I'm sorry. But yeah, this mimics the League Cup. And then we also have, oh, I'm sorry, this is the League Cup. This mimics the, the uh, League Cup in, the, um, in England. And then the National Cup, this is like the uh, FA, FA Trophy. Um, it's only four teams outside the top four, so national and down, where the League Cup is only the league. It's Premier, Championship, League One, League Two. Then you're going to see the Community Shield right here. And I believe, yeah, I tried putting in the Check a Trade trophy, but it actually should not be in there. These ones I cannot get rid of. They're not in my database officially, so that's just sort of weird. But this is it. There, like I said, every team is in here that's in the database. I got rid of all Canadian teams. This is US only. So if you're a fan of Toronto FC or Vancouver White Whitecaps, I'm sorry, but they're gone. Um, we'll also go into the rules here a little bit. Um, it's got payout structure that very closely mimics um, the EPL. These rules should mimic the EPL as well. Transfer windows, you are going to see all of this stuff. Um, let's say qualification, it does not in here, which kind of sucks. I wish it did. But you're going to see the relegations here. Go into here, open this up. Uh, let's actually, let's go into the championship. You can see the rules in that one pretty much the same like i said these are pulled from epl uh Eng or the english pyramid so you know what this is cool stuff i'm pretty excited about it all the same rules as every as every league in england has pretty much if you find something let me know we can always get that fixed um but yeah i am super excited about this uh it's taken me ungodly long to do this but I'm still working on it, still tweaking it. If you have any things you want to see, let me know down below. Shoot me a message on Twitter, DM, whatever. Whatever works for you, I'm available. But that's it. That's the database. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the tour of the database there. Um, the link will be down in the description for you to download. I really appreciate you giving me a like on this one. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe. Hit that little bell so that you know when my videos go up. I will be doing another Chandler FC um, save this year. Uh, last in FM19, I did a Chandler FC save. I've got it built out in the database. A little different um, color scheme to it because, honestly, I've put more effort into it. But I'm also going to be doing a separate to save um, kind of a US journeyman. I've kind of started one already. Um, you know, nothing too crazy in that. Started in the bottom tier and uh, actually just quit earlier today to take another job. So finished one season, finished in dead last 23rd place and uh, left because they would not give me any money to play with and then yelling that I couldn't win any games. So anyhow, hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. If you haven't yet, smash that like button. Check out all the details down below. Thank you so much. Have a great day.